the other thing we do with the samples that, that are brought back is we take a small proportion of the liquid and then put one milliliter in this cell. Now, I've got one of these under the microscope already, which has got one milliliter of sample in it. The cell has a thousand squares on the base of it, and each square can be counted in the microscope, knowing that you're counting one thousandth of the milliliter of water that is put in here. So by knowing what the names of the organisms are that are there, what their biomass is on any one day, how much a flamingo can come along and eat, and then their productivity, which is, if you like, is the biomass for the future, we get a very good idea of how nutritious the lagoons are for flamingos.